Hey Mike, congratulations on your new degree. Doing a nice job. Keep it up. So what are you going to do next? Hey buddy, just want to say I'm happy for you. You did it. I know it was a lot of work, but you're done. Congratulations, man. I'm really happy for you. Next time I see you, we're going to celebrate and we're going to have one of these. Good job, man. Hey, Mike, I'll make this short and sweet. Congrats on the MBA and uh, continued success. Hey, Mike. I heard you were getting a second degree. We're really excited for you. We're although... so excited for you. You managed to steal our thunder. Really? The same, the same month that we're getting a degree for the first time. You couldn't just wait. You couldn't just wait. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's, fine. We're it's really, not. It's we're not. Really, we're really proud of your achievement. We're so proud of you. And we can't wait to see you at the wedding. Why do you have to do that? <laughs> Mike, we're really proud of your new degree, and as a reward, I'm sending you five kittens in the mail. We caught them last weekend. Watch for the box that meows. Congratulations, Mike. We always knew you were smart, and now you have a cool piece of paper to prove it. Congratulations to Uncle Bob from The Little Bob. Yeah. Hi, Michael. Hi, Michael. Congratulations. We're so proud of you. And we know that you're going to go up, up, and away from here, as you always have. Uh, I was going to take a picture of your tree, but Papa didn't think that was a good idea. So anyway, we just wanted you to know we love you and we're proud of you and congratulations. I said congratulations already. Is it off? No. Yeah. Hey Mike, congratulations on your big day and getting your MBA. You know, I was thinking the other day that we've known each other for over 15 years. We met randomly, sat next to each other at freshman orientation at Vider. Coincidentally, was put in the same homeroom and well, I guess later removed and separated from that same homeroom, but we haven't looked back since. And I can honestly say it's been a fun ride since these two idiots met. We've been through a lot together, and but we always seem to make it out on the other end better and smarter. You know, you have a natural ambition to better yourself and a gift of curiosity and the pursuit of knowledge and a preference not to follow social norms, all of which make you a special guy. You prove this by getting your MBA, but not only getting your MBA, but doing it part-time while growing and succeeding at your, perf at your current job. Well done. Uh, you know, I look forward to seeing what's next and helping wherever I can. You know how to reach me. Nice job, buddy. Over and out. Congratulations, Michael. Your mom tells me, or I guess Mike as you like to be called these days, your mom tells me that you've graduated or you're getting your master's degree, which is pretty impressive. You've done twice as much as she's done by this age. Um, but anyway, getting a uh, MBA, your master's in botanicals and agriculture, doesn't really surprise me. Um, I I think MBA, Master's of Business Administration, I think, Jeff. Oh, really? Oh, okay, well, go ahead and turn off. We'll start over. Okay. That's probably a good thing anyway. He, he used to come over to the house when he was like four. He came and planted garlic one time. This millennial age, I mean, you wouldn't believe it. They're like, I mean, he didn't want to get, all he wanted to do is go to the toy store. He didn't want to get dirt under his nails. You know, he didn't want to do any of that stuff. He didn't like the bugs. I imagine he's still that way, you know. He went and married that girl from Virginia. Nice girl. Called they call her Anna, but she's kind of one of those sneaky southerners, you know. Makes great sweet tea, 
Everybody loves her, but I think she's got an edge to her. She's right on that borderline, you know, Mason Dixon line. I, I, I would doubt that. Uh, <laughs> I tell you what, business administration, he's not administering anything in that house. She's going to be controlling that completely. So I don't know what he's going to do with that. I'm sure he'll be, him and his uh, yuppie friends and millennial buddies will be hanging out in the bars talking about their initials, but uh, whatever. Anyway, go ahead. We'll, we'll go ahead and uh, I'll, I'll, I'll get set up to do uh, Masters of Business Administration. Got it. All right. My impression of Bob Noxon. MBA, Mr. Big Ass. Yeah. Say hi, Bacon. Hi, my name's Bacon. I want to say congratulations, Mike. Yeah. I'm so happy. You did good. Yeah. I'd, I'd very much like to say... Somehow, my paw hit the stop button. I'd very much like to celebrate with you. We can lick our butts. I'm good at that. Uh, I'd like to go to Chili's with you one time. That'd be great. Uh, I heard you got a yard. I I like that. Um, you know, I, I really would just like to hang out at all with you. You seem like a cool guy. Um, yeah, well, I'd really like to meet your dog, too. That'd be cool. Um, I'm just so excited for you. Yes, I, I just literally can't contain my emotions for you graduating with your MBA. I heard that because of that, you'll have all the money in the world to, to buy me lots of dog treats because I'm a real good boy. Uh, my dad's, you know, hasn't bought me anything yet. Oh, that was a good one, buddy. Oh, yeah. Breathe a little bit harder. And, uh, yeah. Well, that's about it for me. Uh, you know. Uh, hope you, hope you have a good day. Hey, Mike. Congrats on getting your MBA, buddy. We all wanted to say congrats. Congrats. Love you, bye. Love you, man. Bye. Bye. Hey, Michael. Congratulations. I know we don't really talk much. In fact, I'm pretty sure our longest conversation has been maybe maybe a minute, minute and a half. And to be honest, I thought you already had your master's. But congratulations, man. I'm so happy for you. I'm so proud of you. You know, I know you're just going to go do fantastic things. Congratulations. Oh, sorry about that. By the way, Mike, I heard you're graduating a second time. I guess that's... One time was not good enough for you, but uh, something about an NBA. Only time I ever heard an NBA was basketball, but you know, what the hell? Aunt Payne made a big deal about it, so I was I figured, congratulations. This one's for you, Mike. Mikey, congrats, man. Very, very happy for you uh, on your graduation. Really sorry to uh, to find out that uh, Pam and Chuck couldn't buy your way into the University of Phoenix, <laughs> so you had to settle for DeVry University. Classic. <laughs> Top 10. Uh, yeah, real proud of you, man. You, um, you've you been able to, over the past few years, accomplish something that literally only tens of millions of other people have accomplished in their lifetime. We're so, really proud of you. So, so great job. Um, hey, by the way... Um, <laughs> <laughs> so when you go to school online is it essentially do you just like go to jcrew.com and shop why did it take you so long <laughs> it took you two years to finish this and uh definitely make sure you refill your printer ink on uh graduation day so you can get that that diploma um, <laughs> otherwise i don't i don't know maybe they post it on facebook <laughs> <laughs> <Who knows? laughs> Um, but yeah, man, congratulations. Proud of you. And uh, congratulations. Love soon. you. 
All right. Bye. Hey, Mike, I heard you're getting your MBA. Uh, not sure why, but I thought you had that for a little while now. Uh, but congratulations on catching up to my timeline. Hello, Michael. So your mom reached out, says, can you put together a little video to congratulate you on uh, getting your MBA? And I'm thinking to myself, this guy, good looking cat, phenomenal wife, great job, got cars for days, nice cars, fancy cars. And I'm thinking, Give this guy an MBA too? What the hell? I mean, give. I mean, obviously you earn it, so it's not like it's, you know, given. But it's like, oh, this guy, he's already got it all. And let's just slap another MBA on his resume, huh? Because, you know, why not, huh? All joking aside, Mike, you earned it. You're doing awesome. Kicking butt at life. We're all very lucky to be pals viewer of uh, you and your fam great people congrats hi michael congratulations on getting your mba we're very excited for you we're very proud of you we got you a small token of uh, to celebrate the day we got you a propane gas detector for the next time you go camping with your grandfather and your father it's a one-time use kit and we really hope you like it. Be careful. Congratulations. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Mike, congratulations. We're really proud of you. And we know that you're into the big bucks now and you can just get anything your little heart desires. Congratulations! congratulations. My bad. I had the wrong way. Congrats, my phone ball, to be honest with you. Didn't think you were going to make it this far. Mike, congrats on the MBA. That's amazing, man. I'm pumped for you. You've come a long way from the marina days. May you never have to fill another drink machine with ice. Now, I'm looking forward to celebrating with you in July. It's going to be a lot of fun, man. Congrats. Hi, Michael. It's Aunt Robin. It's April 28th. 2019, your sweet mom made a request for everyone to, um, let me turn this on mute. This is like uncut. Okay. Um, your mom made a request for us to send you a congratulations video on getting your master's. So I'm doing mine right away because A, I'm old AF and I will forget. And if your mom doesn't know what AF stands for. I'm sure you members of the youth committee can tell her. Um, I just made it rated R. Okay, um, so, so anyway, congratulations on something funny. Um, I guess, I don't know what really funny I can say about your master's degree, but I can say that my funniest memory of someone graduating would be your mom and her physics debacle and i can laugh with her not at her because i've never taken physics ever in my life not even in high school because i was scared anyway um that's really all i have not super funny but very proud of our very first nephew um not surprised and um enjoy your free time now the heck? Is that Tony? Tony, what are you? Is that you? I haven't seen you forever. What are you doing? Nick, Nick. What are you doing? Are you homeless? Yes. Tony, I'm, Michael's graduating. I'm trying to get you to talk to him. My, Michael, our cousin? Yeah, that Michael. Cousin Michael. Michael, I haven't seen you in years. It must have changed a little bit since the last time you saw him. Michael. I heard, I heard you got your MBA or something like that. Um, get, yeah, congratulations, Michael. Let me clean up a little bit. Bro. Mike, 
while you've been working on your MBA. I've been trying to work on my golf game. Hasn't gotten any better. Anyways, hey, congratulations, bud. Hope to see you soon. Take care. Tequila. Hi, Michael. I heard that you just finished your MBA degree, so I wanted to congratulate you. I was gonna try to think of something clever or funny to say, but I don't know of any good business jokes, but I'm sure your uncles aren't gonna disappoint you. I've been in grad school for the past year, and I know that it's definitely not easy. You accomplish something that probably most people aren't gonna accomplish in their lifetime. And although I'm sure that you are gonna do plenty more great things, none of them are gonna have to involve going to school, and that's something to be excited about. So I hope you enjoy your weekend celebrating, and hopefully I'll see you soon. Mikey, we're here in beautiful Croatia. When we get home, you are graduating. You have taken a test while we're here. I have no idea how. You're about to do work while you're here. Again, I don't know how you do it. You've made this look so effortless and the animals and I are so proud of you and we love you so very much. So congrats on graduating. We look forward to letting the fun continue. <laughs>